Good afternoon. Good morning. Hello. Mike Burgoyne with Mexico Real Estate Solutions. Uh, hope you're having a great day. I'm checking out this fabulous, fabulous house in Baje Principe. I uh, want you to check it out with me. Interesting. I'm going to walk and talk my way through this thing for everyone. This house is a four bed, four and a half bath, almost 6,500 square feet of construction. Inside Bahia Principe, inside the gated community of Tau, even. You learn something new, you go and do something, you learn something new all the time. This is one of only two full-size proper standalone homes. There are some other villas, some other little casas by Tao, but this is a custom build and I'm excited about it. New on the market for us at Mexico Real Estate Solutions. Check out this front entrance. How cool is that? Massive doors, solid wood effect of the the entrance even how fun is this have a look at the impression when you come in all the way up all the way up wow, the great breeze And you see here, sliding glass, full height. I, when I get closer, I'll tell you if it's 10 feet or how high it is. But this is, this is just a, such an amazing, I'm speechless, I'm stammering. Front entrance impression. Let's head over this way. So you've got high ceilings in the living area and great formed concrete. Detail all the way up, on both sides as you come in. It's a really nice sitting living area. A house designed by and for architects as their as their own family home. Putting my shoes back on because I'm going to wander outside with you. It's a big house, so it's going to be a little longer video, but okay. So check. I mean, this is to me spectacular. These sliding doors slide all the way open. I didn't have a chance to do that. They've got dogs yelling at me back there somewhere. So I'm going to get it closed. But the whole, the whole back of the house slides open. So when you're entertaining, your inside space becomes outside. And yeah, I'm looking up, oh, she's 10, 12 feet high glass, the back of the house. Um, so we just finished up a bit of a stormy period. They've got some new white rock coming. Uh, the house is seven years old, as is the deck outside and in. So that decking is, uh, is you know, it's time for it to be replaced. Of course, we've got a tree going up in the living room, right? Trees. Uh, so that's open to the outside. So of course, when it rains, it rains here, which is why, you know, this is a smart finish. I was just speaking with the homeowner asking, you know, how do you, how about the storms, you know, the hurricanes we get occasionally in the area. You know, we've only had one, thankfully, in 2021, but I'm just showing you the door. There's no glass here. Mosquito screens. So you just got great fresh air coming through. Uh, okay, so I, we're still already four minutes into the video. Sorry, the house is asking price around 1.15. Give you the numbers real quick. Uh, it's almost 6,500 square feet of construction. And I think I already said, you know, built seven years, seven years ago. They've got a fully removed guest bedroom over here, which is really cool. 
doors open all the way so you can feel like you're actually sleeping in the jungle. That's really cute. It's not a bad view from the guest bedroom. And of course it has a full shower or bathroom. I got here before the touch-up crew and contractors could, so there's some light bulbs, etc. out. So bear with me. And also now that we're through the storm season, it's time for um, the outside of the house to get painted. And I'll show you what it looks like because that's why we're here. Check it all out. Look at all that glass. And then upstairs, we've got a master bedroom. And then the two kids' bedrooms are up here. That makes the four bedroom. And of course, on this side, we've got well, a great space to have morning coffee. And then a massive dining area. Of course, the table is designed for this space, custom made. Again, you know, I'm not sure if you can see it, but you know, the golf course is right back here. Again, we're in Bahia Principe. Uh, okay, I'll show you the kitchen. It's a proper working kitchen. A little more on the formal side. You know, having a closed entrance, but loads and loads of storage. Any type of coffee you could imagine. Um, great refrigerator and, you know, smart, smart storage solutions. Like the sliding pantry business. And we're, I mean, we're at the end of the street here, so there's no neighbors to really worry about hanging around outside. Uh, I'll, I'll explain this. There is a, um, a housekeeping a quarters, bedroom, laundry room, and this like a separate service entrance um, right there. And half bath we spoke of is here. I really, again, I like that formed concrete as a finish. We can talk about the marble floors in here. If you watch any of my videos, you know I'm a sucker for beautiful floors. It's a beautiful Mexican marble, gold marble. Um, we're going to run upstairs and I'll show off some more great space up there for you. A couple of lights. Marble staircase. Of course, with some nice accent lighting. And then as you look up, I can do that for you. Load the glass again. Try to do it slowly so you don't get dizzy as you're watching. great holes in that form concrete for some natural lighting and effects and at the top you've got another nice nice living and working space two bedrooms here and again with the attention to the glass in the window it's pretty awesome Massive bedroom, you got room for another queen bed in here if you decided that's what you needed, but I think this is more a home for living or a vacation home, vacation property. Um, more than a rental type property. But great jungle views here, the air is fresh, there's no air conditioning on. 
and uh, yeah, very nice and comfortable. Good storage here too. Of course, ensuite bath, shower. Hello. Great natural light in there too. You see it? There's no lights on. Lights on behind me. Off. So yeah, surrounded by window everywhere, which of course when you're in the jungle is really nice. Same, same, same type bedroom space. Maybe, maybe it's a hair smaller. And then of course, same ensuite space. But good jungle views. The birds are chirping a little bit right now, but in the mornings it'd be pretty, uh, pretty special. Actually, here, let me show you this. So we're gonna go upstairs to the roof terrace doesn't look like much, but it's a sliding door. Laundry chute to below, a little bit of storage space and Here, I mean, you're into sunsets. There's gonna be a spectacular one here in about 30 minutes. It's finished with a nice tile flooring. Um, really all you need is a little bit of furniture, maybe a pergola, and you've got a great outdoor lounging area. You can see we're here, we're over top of the living space where your trees come into life. Get the occasional bird in there. I did ask. No bats, so that's nice. I know you didn't ask, but I'm telling you. And then here we are. Heading towards the master or main principal bedroom, I think is the proper way to call it today. I can't keep up, but we'll do what I can. So even from the main bedroom, you've got light into this, the living space, because of course with the skylights, you've got loads of natural light. And then behind me in the front of the house, some glass on order being replaced next week. Great big door, double hinge coming into the main bedroom. That full height glass look, it's just awesome. Huge, huge, huge bedroom, really. The living room set in here. And for better airflow, you see how they left it open across the top so the humidity doesn't get trapped in the bathroom with the, the showers, etc. Well, showers, just the showers. The closet on each side. And the nice jacuzzi tub. An open shower. So much daylight in these these bathrooms. There's no. I don't think I turned the lights on in any of them. But, and that's the house. I thought it was pretty special when I first saw it, and I knew right away that this was something I needed to get out 
and show off. We look spectacular at night too with all these great accent lights throughout. And there we are. Here I am, here you are. Uh, Mike Burgoyne with Mexico Real Estate Solutions. I wanna say thank you for watching the video. If it was interesting or, or not, tell me. I look forward to your comments as, as always. So thank you for watching. Uh, click like, subscribe, and uh, copy paste the link and share it with some friends. I look forward to seeing you next time. Um, enjoy the rest of your day. Bye for now.